Well, thank you for proving my daughter's point. Is that, daughter? Yeah, she said that the, the female cops are always much nicer. And <laughs> I've, I've been taping asshole cops for the past week, and you're the first person who was nice. And you're also the first thank female you. we've dealt with, so thank you. I'm going to show her this video and tell her she was right. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, unfortunately, we can't all, like, police the same way. It's yeah. all discretion. It's yeah. all, you know, I, for me, talking to people is a big thing. Mm. And the way you talk to people is a big thing. <laughs> so. aggressively panhandling so I don't think I'm breaking any laws. You're not. Hi. Hi. I'll talk to you in a second. One okay. second. I'm not. I'm pretty sure you made that. By, pretty said. sure you made that up. Okay. I've only been here a few minutes, so I, I really doubt people have gone in and complained at this point because virtually nobody has walked by. Okay. You're not like harassing people. Not saying a word to anybody. Or... Haven't said a word to anybody except thank you to the one lady who gave me ten dollars. Okay. Well, you know that's that's all right. You have every right to be here. Thank you. Um, I mean, just make sure you're not obstructing the sidewalk and, and people. You give people a nice little walkway right here to walk by. Of course. You know. Some people are just a little intimidated. Of course. That's all. All right. Uh, to each their own. I'm just gonna take some of your info down. Sure. Okay? It's not a ticket. No problem. Can like me that. get my ID out for you? Perfect. Yeah, if you have that. Not only really do I have it, I've been handing it to cops awesome. about four times in the past 48 hours. No, this will be the fifth. Is that right? Yeah. From this same location? No, no. It's my first time here. Well, okay. since I used to work here when it was Lucky's back in the 90s. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Before your time, though. Yeah. Was it for the same stuff? Did no, I used to you? work here at L Lucky's when oh, it was no, Lucky's. Oh, no, I mean, um, when oh, no, the I, other officers uh, were talking to well, you. Well, let's see. The, was it for panhandling? Or? No, for existing in Ocean Beach. I was told I had to move on, and then I started to move on, and I was told I wasn't moving on fast enough. Then I was woken up the next morning by cops who gave us a ticket. And then I was woken up this morning at 4.30 in the morning by a cop telling us that we couldn't sleep in the place we were sleeping even though there's not a letter on file and nobody made a complaint. So we're actually pursuing a uh, internal affairs investigation for the one this morning because that was a bit egregious. She seemed to just be there to wake us up in uh, Hillcrest. Hillcrest? Yeah. So you kind of go all over, yeah? I... Do what I gotta do. Yeah, I mean, this is La Jolla, so yeah. technically it's it's just like the border between PV and La Jolla. Yeah. So obviously we get a lot more calls out here. We get more store owner store owner. Yeah, he say, came out quick. Like I said, the security store owner they can say whatever they want. Really, yeah. if you're if you're on the property in the store, they don't want you there. You come, tell you to leave. You leave. You know, that's all you gotta do. Yeah, and I'm not on the property, yeah, like here, I said. You're so. fine. Uh, and I actually tried to get on the last bus, but he won't let me on because there's too much stuff. So I would have really? I would have left if the last bus driver let me on. So we'll do you see have what. A, do you have a phone number? Uh, three nine four mm -hmm. zero two eight. Where's that? Where are you born? Uh, New Jersey. Jersey, that's yeah. cool. <laughs> Yeah, you don't see many people start with the zeros. No, I don't. Yeah, I just had someone the other day, and I meant to ask them <laughs> where the heck they were born. 
But what's weird is that I was born in New York, so I would think I'd have a different one, but my first, my, I forget what it's, it's like, it starts with like a six, but it's the same as everyone else in my family who was born in California. That's weird. I'm not sure but what. I moved pretty recently after I was born, so I don't know if that was I, it, but I always I left, wondered. I left New Jersey when I was six months old, so I, yeah. I don't know, I don't know if that had anything to do with it, or I don't know. I don't know what they base it on, but I know it's rare. Well, thank you for proving my daughter's point. Is that, daughter? yeah, she said that the, the female cops are always much nicer. And <laughs> I've, I've been taping asshole cops for the past week, and you're the first person who was nice. And you're also the first female we've dealt with. So thank you. I'm going to show her this video and tell her she was right. <laughs> yeah, I mean, unfortunately, we can't all, like, police the same way. It's yeah. all discretion. It's yeah. all, you know. I, for me, talking to people is a big thing, mm. and the way you talk to people is a big thing. So people, co some yeah. cops don't realize if you escalate it, it escalates, and yeah. if you don't, it doesn't. Yeah. I've seen them do it so many times. They did it four o'clock this morning when they woke us up. Yeah. Okay. Seth, <sighs> do you, you think you might, you, if you have any warrants or anything like no, that? No. No. Not America's Most Wanted. I like I said, they've run me four times in the last forty-eight hours. But you're welcome to do it again if okay. you like. I'm just gonna do it real quick. Sure. Because I got it. I understand. I guess I'll wait. I'll skip this bus then. You gotta wait for them, yeah. Just, take forever. Take time. Well, I just missed that bus, so I got another 20 minutes. And it turns out this is a much less uh, traffic than I thought, so I probably would have moved on anyway. Yeah, <laughs> I know that's the thing too. Like PB is usually a good spot because you get the college students, and mm. most this, of the time the college students, like, like I was like that too when I was in college. Like, giving, just yeah. Give stuff out. Yeah. People are like that. Yeah, me too. I Up went here, to... it's, it's La Jolla. You yeah. Know, so. Well, the, the the key is to find the one person who hands a $50 bill. Makes up for all the yeah. people in the Mercedes who just drive by and give me a snobby look. Yeah. <laughs> so if you plan on, you know, heading heading down somewhere else, that's that's up to you. I guess I'm gonna I, stay here. Yeah, um, I appreciate that. But you know, if they call us again, then I'll probably just if we do if I'm the same one that comes back, just go down the street or that way or something. I'm going to try to get on each bus so we'll we'll, okay. we'll see uh thanks we'll see uh this technically is illegal to bring this yeah. much stuff on the bus so it's each driver's discretion so I got Zero two eight five two four three nine four. At least it's cooled down a little bit. Yeah, that. It was been nasty the past. Yeah, that was days. that was brutal. And I just can't imagine you know, standing in the heat that long. Yeah, it was brutal. <laughs> yeah. There's your buddy. muggy out here. Yes, it is. I, was, I spoke too soon. I was saying it felt nice and cool for a second, and then... So when the sun pops out, it gets now hot. I just feel gross. As soon as the sun goes away, it gets cool again. Yeah. How you doing? I'm good. Good morning. And what was, what's your name? Your, your badge, your name tags covered? 
Oh, sorry. That's right. This, these pockets are really small. Officer Estrada, like yeah. Eric Estrada. But I get that a lot. <laughs> I bet you do. <laughs> but actually, a little too much. I actually have an uncle, Eric Estrada. Oh, really? <laughs> Thank you. I'm sure you knew. You were good. Uh -huh. okay. Thank so you very much. Okay, so like I said, if you if you want to just alleviate, I'm the I'm gonna try to get on each bus. Day, so just, you know, it's up to the bus drivers but, um, at this I'll point. I'll let them know that and okay. not to be calling us for yeah. you know all the kinds of little things. Yeah. So we okay. should be okay. All right. Thank you. you I have appreciate a good day, it. Seth. You too. Thank you. Police officer Ciara Estrada, 25, of San Diego, California, formerly from Murrieta, California, passed away on Monday, January 1st, 2018. She was born on February 13th, 1992, in Long Island, New York. Ciara was the adored daughter of Larry and Julie Estrada of Murrieta, beloved sister of Matthew, Brandy, and Cheyenne Estrada. She was a loving sister-in-law to Jeffrey Curtis and shared the role of godmother to Cashton Curtis along with her sister Cheyenne. Ciara, a Murrieta resident for 12 years, graduated from Vista Murrieta High School in 2010. While in high school, she was the executive officer of the Air Force Junior ROTC program. Ciara attended San Diego State University and graduated cum laude with a bachelor's degree in criminal justice and a minor in sociology. She made the dean's list all four years of college. She loved being an Aztec and wore the colors proudly. She found her strength and passion on the water, where she rowed varsity crew and was named a National Collegiate Scholar Athlete and Conference USA Honor Roll. Ciara began her career with the San Diego Police Department after graduating from the Police Academy in August of 2015. As a law enforcement officer, she was assigned to the Northern Division. She dedicated her life to the community of San Diego, safeguarding lives and protecting the innocent. She was loved and humbled to be a proud member of the brotherhood and sisterhood of the Thin Blue Line. When she wasn't in uniform, she spent most of her time with her beloved dog, Trevor, and visited her much cherished family. She would take him to dog beaches and parks and give him the best care possible. She was an incredible dog mother and loved him dearly. Rest in peace, Ciara Estrada. It's back in the 90s. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Before your time, though. Yeah. I should be so lucky.